Hola amigos, welcome to the third day of the Dakar Rally. Today we were at the checkpoint, uh, approximately 190 kilometers after the start. It was a tough day and it was also a hard day for Nicola. Uh, you will see why uh, later on in this video. But first we go to Elena, his wife, um, for an interview. Hi Elena. Hi everybody. Um, you're Nicola's wife? Yes, I am. Today we're at the third day of the Dakar. Exactly. How do you feel about it? I feel very exciting because uh, now we feel good because this morning we think that uh, we Nicola has a little bit problem with the ribs so yesterday we have a little crash on the dunes and so yesterday night we have a lot of pain but uh, physiotherapy took the tape and uh, the tabs for for the pain and this morning you wake up very strong and today the, the, the third stage is going to be good. We hope it's very long, very long today. Today is very long, and uh, tomorrow is a marathon stage. So more tomorrow is uh, even longer than today. Is uh, not a long, not more longer, but more difficult because at the end of the stage they can uh, use the help of mechanics. Here, Nicolas' team arrives at the checkpoint. Just before taking off, the police officer that was holding Nicola wasn't paying attention and that's when Nicola fell down. When Nicola fell down, the crowd ran over to help Nicola. Together with one of his ghost riders, they were able to uh, bring Nicola back up and of course Nicola was able to, uh, to take off again. After a short fuel break and some food, the team continued and finished the third day of the Dakar Rally.